It takes two, always, to make or break a relationship. So if you are feeling like it's all your fault that this relationship fell apart or ended, then I, I really, I, I commend you for that because I think far too many people don't take responsibility. And I think the only way we can learn anything at all from going through a breakup is by taking responsibility and by looking at our part and what we can do better. However, if you are taking blame for something that you really need to recognize was your ex causing, you also need to look at like cause and reaction, right? You know, and it's like I'm talking about this because I was talking to a client the other day who fully recognized that he'd kind of gotten depressed and dropped off from where he'd started from in the relationship. And he was owning that and he was recognizing that that's why he'd pushed his girlfriend away. But in talking further to him, I came to realize that she'd stopped having sex with him. She'd completely changed her behavior. She was completely taking all these wonderful things that he was doing for her, and she really wasn't giving anything back. So yeah, he ended up getting depressed. So wh what I said to him was, okay, yeah, it's great that you're recognizing that, that that was your part in it, that that's what you did, but she caused you to get there. You didn't get there on your own. Like she was this wonderful, loving girlfriend and then you became depressed and she left you because of it. So what I'm trying to say to you is it's wonderful if you're taking responsibility for your part and that's the only way you learn and that's the only way you grow and get better. And that's a great thing, but it's not good if you're accepting all the blame for something that really was not your fault and, and, and your ex was the catalyst of. And the beauty in recognizing that is it can help you recognize that that wasn't a good relationship and that they weren't loving to you and that you need to let them go. So while you're doing all this self recognition, really honestly look at how your ex treated you and how they made you feel. And most importantly, were you getting your needs met? You'll get over this a lot faster than you might think if you really analyze how loved they made you feel, how good they were to you, how much they cared about your feelings and the things that you needed. And if that's not what was happening, then you are so much better off without that relationship. Those are an absolute requirement for any relationship if you're going to be happy.